Hey guys, it's Way here, and welcome to a video on all of the brand new uh, winter upgrades that have come out into FIFA 16 Ultimate Team. This is going to be the second batch right here. Uh, the first batch was a week ago. They're going to be, bring, be bringing out one each week. And uh, yeah, there are a lot of very good hidden gems in this upgrade here. Uh, I've got all the gold players that I have found so far uh, in three different concept squads. I will leave a link in, uh, in the description down below though to go and check out. Uh, EA's uh, page which does show all the silver and bronze players who have also been upgraded I'm just going to be showing you guys the gold players because if not it will take about one hour to do this video right here Also, sorry about the audio on yesterday's video Basically, uh, I cannot actually hear the videos after I've edited them because I don't have my uh, Like headphones working at the moment because my headphone slots broken, but I am going to be mending that in the future but uh, yeah, without further ado, let's start off here with the highest rated one, and that is Robert Lewandowski going from an 86 to an 88. Very deserved upgrade, and uh, all of his special cards have also gone up uh, by the uh, required amount. Then got Petr Cech going up to an 86, being a very good keeper in the Premier League. We've got Di Maria moving to our right winger, and uh, 86 rating overall, very nice there. We've got Higuain going up to an 86 with, a, a, again, a very nice card. Got Gondawan going up to an 83. Mkhitaryan going up from an 81 to an 83. Really nice upgrade there. We've got Payet going up to an 82. We've got Lukaku going up to an 82 as well. Harry Kane going up from a non-rare to a rare uh, 81 rated player. We've got Matip there at uh, an 81. Dybala, one of my favourite players on this game now, an 81 rated player. I'm going to be uh, probably building a team around him pretty soon in the future. We've then got Gabby going up to an 81. Lamella there going up to an 80 and he could possibly get uh, his skills upgraded too in the future. Then got Arnautovic going up to a 79. Soldado there going up to an 80. We've got Basta there with a really nice pace upgrade going up to an 80 rated player. Now looks like probably the best right back in uh, the Serie A. We've then got uh, Timo Horn going up to an 80. Karius going up to a 79. Ilicic going up to a 79 as well. We've got Murillo going up to a 79. Uh, we've got Marcano here going up to 79 as well. Dos Santos there, uh, now he has got 70 pace, he looks uh, a bit better than he used to, he's got nice passing and dribbling as well, he has gone up to a 79, then got Wernbloom going up to a 79 as well, and uh, yeah, that is the first concept squad done, so you can see all the players right here. Moving on to the second concept squad, which is this one right here, we have got, starting off with this guy here, Bakumbu, and he looks like an absolute beast, look at those stats, he's been upgraded from a 73 rated silver I do believe, to a 79 rated gold he's now a rare player and 86 pace 80 dribbling 76 physical 77 shooting and 71 passing looks very very nice that he's going to be a real hidden gem on this game then got comes he's been upgraded to a 78 braithwaite there going up to a 78 nice upgrade there kalu going to a 78 uh kalanich going from a silver there to a 78 rated gold player looks quite good got Lopez there going to a 78. Vent, who is, uh, I think he's the only outfield player to have a one-star weak foot. He has gone up to a 77 rated player there. We've got Trash going up to a 75. No, 77, sorry. We've got uh, Kiyo Take going up to a 77. He's also moved from a left winger, I think, to a cam. We've then got Fernando going up to a 77. Nice, a non-rare card there for him. We've got Sport Yellow. Uh, who's had some really nice upgrades on his stats there and actually looks like a really good keeper. He's 6'4 as well, going up to a 77 right there. Then got a Niasse, nice card for him, going up to a 77. Uh, Al Suwali going to a 77 as well. Halli Hovic, really nice upgrade here. He's now become a rare gold player. He's got four star skills and he is in the league of BBVA. You can get good chemistry links to the likes of Modric, Rakitic, and also Kovacic. Really, really nice card there. Good pace, good dribbling, and a good shooting. We've got Oroban going to a 77. Vieira they're going to a 77 as well Boca going to a 77 quite a nice card there as well 84 pace and 80 dribbling got Suchi really nice non rare card there low high work rates good pace defending and physical he's gone up to a 77 Houlihan they're going to a 76 uh, we've got Sinclair now this card is a very very nice upgrade 88 pace 80 dribbling uh, he has now got four star skills as well and he is a rare left winger. He will cost you quite a bit at the moment, but so all these players will drop down in price pretty soon. And yeah, he's got a very, very nice card indeed. Then got Lecomte going up to a 76. Endoy there going up to a 76 from a silver rated player. We've got Mendy, another really nice upgrade here because now you can get a hyperlink to Hatem Ben Arfa. Uh, and uh, yeah, you can build some nice hybrids around uh, that link there and uh, yeah he's got quite a nice card as well medium high work crates and pretty well rounded stats then got uh, Bakumbu again so that is the end of this squad so now let's move on to the uh, the final squad here 
And uh, yeah, we've got, again, quite a lot of hidden gems there. We start off with Skelger Bread. He's gone up to a 76. We've then got Hits going up to, to a 76 as well. We've got Tete. He's actually gone up by like 10 pace. And uh, he is a 76 now as well. We've got Akerabi going to a 76. We've got Martins. Really nice upgrade here. 92 pace, 83 dribbling, and 4 star skills, and 4 star weak foot. He's 6 foot 1 as well. He's gone up to a 76. We've then got Bruno Cesar. Another really nice upgrade moving from a 73 red to silver to a 76 rated goal player with 80 shooting, 81 passing, and a pretty nice pace, dribbling, and a physical as well. We've then got uh, Bergara moving from a centre mid to a CDM. Uh, and going to a 76 rated player overall. We've got Lassen going to a 76. Uh, Rico going from a silver there to a, a 76 rated player. 6 foot 4 looks like quite a nice card. We've then got Bacali, another really nice upgrade. Uh, 88 pace, 84 dribbling, 4 star skills, 4 star weak foot, and uh, he's gone to a 76 rated goal player from uh, being a non rare. Uh, no, I think he was actually a rare silver player. But uh, yeah, really nice stats there, and he's also a rare player now as well. We've got Mora, 4 star skills, 4 star weak foot. Alright stats for him going from a silver to a 75 rated player. We've got Cells going to a 75 as well. Eric Peters going to a 75. Uh, we've got Hradecki going to a 75. Garcia, really nice card. He's 6 foot 3, 82 physical, good pace and defending as well. He has gone up to a rare 75 rated silver player, which is a really nice upgrade right there. We've then got Matip. Uh, he has gone to a, a 75 rated rare player as well. Another really nice upgrade. Good pace, good defending, and good physical. We've got Carl's Jill. He has gone up to a 75. He used to be a silver. We've got Muriel, and he's currently going for actually about 50k. But uh, yeah, if he didn't play FIFA 14, he was one of the most overpowered players on that game. People we used to link him and Barbo and Freddy Guaran up together back in the day. And yeah, he was an extremely overpowered player. And he used to be a silver. He has now been upgraded though to a gold player. And I can't wait to try him out and build some pretty cool teams around him. But yeah, he does go for uh, around about 50k at the moment, which is um, his maximum price range. We've then got Umbai Nyang, another great kind of hidden gem beast of a player. You can get a hyperlink to... Um, I believe it is Menez. Yeah, you can get a hyperlink to him, which is pretty cool. You can get strong links to the likes of Pogba, Balotelli, people like that. 86 pace, 83 dribbling, 4 star skills, 4 star weak foot, and he's 6 foot tall, so really, really nice upgrade for him. Going to a rare 75 rated goal player. We have got Vecino there as well, 6 foot 2. Uh, Alright card for him. We've got Mina, he is uh, playing for Valencia there in the BBVA, going up to 75. We've got Tessone there going up to a 75 rated player as well. Uh, Devic here, he has uh, gone up to a 75. And uh, yeah, that is the end of this concept squad here. So you can see all the players right here on screen. The main ones being Niang and Muriel. Really looking forward to trying those guys out. Also Garcia and Matip, both with some really nice upgrades. I'll definitely be using them in the future. Martins and Bruno Cesar both look really nice as well, as does Bacali. And yeah, overall we've got a lot of really, really nice transfer players in uh, this uh, in this video here who have been upgraded and look just generally very, very OP or very, uh, like, they've had really good upgrades in the stats that uh, are really important, like pace, dribbling, shooting like that. Bakumbu looks like another really good uh, beast. Braithwaite looks good. Kalinac looks quite good. Uh, we've got a lot of great players and generally just really looking forward to using these players. Also, um, Halihovic, uh, Sinclair, Mendy, all those players here. But there have been a lot of upgrades for kind of the 74 rated, 73 rated silver players to move up to low rated goals, which is a really good because that's kind of uh, made them a lot more accessible for people um, because they're going to be cheaper. Like the, the top end silver players go for a lot, but now they are a goal they are going to be a lot cheaper. Then obviously we do have all of the uh, high rated gold players there. Definitely going to be trying out Dybala. Looks like an absolute beast on this game. I've used his normal card, uh, like his non-upgraded card, and that's probably my favourite card on this game. So I can't wait to use that. We'll be building a team around him pretty soon in the future. Also got uh, Lewandowski, all these high rated players. So obviously, really nice upgrades for them. Especially Higuain, he's going to be quite cheap, but still have a great card. And yeah, Basta, he look, now looks like one of the best right backs in this area. Got Arnautovic there with a nice upgrade. Uh, we've got Ilicic there. He actually looks quite good. Good passing and dribbling. He'd be a good false nine. Murillo, uh, you can get a strong link to the likes of Zapata. And you can get a hyperlink to Freddy Guarin. So a nice card there. And also Dos Santos. Now he has been upgraded. Uh, he's got over 70 base. Looks a bit more appealing there. But so yeah, hope you did enjoy this video. If you did, smash the like, subscribe if you're new. And as always, I'll see you guys in my next video. Take care.